and questions still being asked how this provocative video shoot was allowed to happen using Houston fire trucks. Tonight, Mayor Sylvester Turner is joining the chorus of critics promising accountability. Our Marcelino Benito spoke with the mayor today. Marcelino, what more did the mayor have to say? Well, Mia, the mayor is clearly troubled by what he saw happen here at Station 46, but he says when the investigation is complete, those responsible will face consequences. By now you've seen the video, bikini clad women dancing on city of Houston fire trucks. That's totally unacceptable. Now Mayor Sylvester Turner reacting to what was filmed outside Station 46, one of Houston's busiest fire stations. I don't care who you are, number one, you're still city employees. Uh, and these are city assets and city buildings. Um, and engaging in any sort, allowing or permitting in any shape, form or fashion, those type of racy videos at a fire station on fire equipment, that's this public station, public equipment is unacceptable. And tonight we're learning more about Fire Station 46. There's a total of five fire trucks housed at the station. 14 firefighters are assigned there. Each of the four shifts have two captains on duty each day. Everybody is held accountable and um, I trust Chief Pena will thoroughly investigate it and people will be held accountable and they will. What impact this racy video shoot may have had on calls during that time remains a key part of the investigation. It is not permissible, it is not acceptable, it's not allowable and we are not going to allow it and the disciplinary actions will follow. Now, I did also speak to a spokesperson who represents some of the women seen dancing in that video. She says the women feel absolutely awful about what happened. They never intended to get firefighters in any trouble. And if they could do it all over again, they would have never stopped to ask to, for permission to pose in front of those city fire trucks. Back to you. With the very latest, Marcin Benito, thank you.